Um, for 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 the rounds that we've been able to do so far, um, we are very clear in our mind that uh, the flooding around the secondary school area, which has been terrible, is basically an engineering problem um, that needs some funding to get it fixed. Um, we come to realize that um, we have some things around this area. And over time, I think that those lands have been sold and the permit has been given by the assembly for the permit. Currently, as we speak, you see that the rainfall part of itself has also changed. So the volume system have just increased. And that's also a major difficulty that we have to look at as a climate change issue, uh, as a country, so that um, we continue to reduce our carbon uh, emissions and then reducing the temperatures that we generating so much rain for these days. So I think that that is one aspect of it. But so far, with the problem that we have now, it's an engineering problem, and the engineers will have to come and then uh, get us some huge storm drains so that we can move the water from the top uh, up here down here into the into the rain river. Uh, and that is kind of doing what we do. So how soon? Um, this is a very huge uh, investment. This is a very huge investment and definitely we can look at the immediate uh, remedial measures like opening up the smaller drains here so they can move down here. Uh, that's what we can do immediately uh, as an assembly. But as we are also going to fix the main road, uh, we would like to them to include this storm drain as part of saving the road that we be constructed uh, from year to end. So it's something that we are going to bring on board as part of the design to keeping this road uh, that is going to be constructed uh, uh, safer uh, and for it to also last longer. We, we know that the major road is under construction, but you can see that this short place has been destroyed by the heavy of the rain. Yes. Is there going to be any Oh, yeah, immediately it will be immediate measures uh, from sorry from the bridge all the way to maybe a point uh, junction. Um, I think that we'll get we'll get that one fixed immediately after the rain um, settles. So is there any message for those who have been developing their uh, uh, they have been, they have been developing the roadside? Those who have acquired land along the roadside. Uh, basically, they are all temporary structures. You can see it's just that they keep filling it up to use them for temporary structures. Um, what I would advise, basically, is that now that we don't have a permanent solution to the problem, uh, people should be cautious.